left exit. Exit the traffic circle. So I just had a great photo shoot. Um, how I know it's great is because we're already working on another shoot um, for uh, Gerald's next dog. Um, Nala was great. Uh, he told me what he wanted more or less, which was only two different ideas, uh, around two or three. And after that, I just said, well, let's have her do her thing and let her walk around and be herself. So that's when I, I felt like I got the best photos out of her because she was in her element and in her zone, having fun running around and stuff like that. Um, she's a hefty dog, so I knew after about a minute or two she was going to slow down. And there's things to take in mind when you take photos. Um, when you meet a client and they say they want a photo done, um, you should ask them for a time and place. Always be there early to recon the area really quick to get some ideas flowing of what you want done and ideas they might be interested in for your client and knock them out. So I did exactly that and it wor all worked out. And had a good session. I was here for about an hour. Um, made some made a new friend and I'm gonna say a pretty good pretty good client a future client wants more photo sessions done and the thing I would recommend when you're taking photos with animals um, there's some people that are different they want it to where it's all posed and if they give you if your client and your photographer and they say hey um, this is what I want done the rest is up to you um, just keep in mind to let the animals be themselves don't let them don't don't try to force animals to do something or not let them what is that right there what is that did i just find a nugget oh people <laughs> what should i do with this i don't know i think somebody just dropped a nugget for me but um yeah i would say with animals just let them do their their thing if there's a a park for dogs let them run around um, but be mindful I would say set it up if a client says they don't know they just want photos it's your job to do your research and see what's around and and get every scenario in your head that you can think of so that way you're not stumped and you don't look lost so I was well, well prepared today I just didn't know the area but it's all kind of common sense a lot of little hills look at this place so there's a dog park Nice running route. I'm out here with the one and only Rowist. What's up, guys? He is Happy Super Bowl. Happy Super Bowl. Um, he's going for the Jets. Um, they're not in there. <laughs> but this is what he's doing. We can he got, he got some fat ass steaks on the grill. So what is your secret of cooking? Pay attention. <laughs> We're all about to take shots. Happy Super Bowl people. It's my shot. We're over here. We went on our trip to uh, Barstow. If you haven't seen that, y'all need to check it out. We found some monies. But, and also if you've seen it, you know Rose got uh, his own clothing brand. And he said it's about to come out soon, some new stuff. Just started printing, should be out uh, maybe in another week or so. We'll do a sneak peek. Sneak, sneak peek. I already told him I want to take photos for him, so. It's on camera. <laughs> it's on camera, people. <laughs> I missed it. It's back. <laughs>